Good morning. So we are leaving Black Mesa State Park, kind of. We're heading to the actual Black Mesa site soon. We're not gonna do a walk up it and back down because I said it was like six hours up and down. So we're just gonna go view it and we're gonna go see the dinosaur footprints. Kleina, are you excited? Yeah. You can do it, Corduroy, you can do it. We are going straight up a hill. <laughs> oh yeah, and I forgot to mention, last night we saw five shooting stars, which is amazing in one night. And then on our way back to our campsite, we saw a bat. It almost flew right into us until I realized like, ah, oh, it's pretty. This little valley down there. So cute. Yeah, this is my view from the toilet. I don't know how well you can see it, but. It's pretty awesome. <laughs> you guys want to see where we're having breakfast? All right, time to go look for some dinosaur footprints. <laughs> this is crazy. These are dinosaur footprints. What? Oh my gosh. That is so cool. What? And they, go, they just keep going in here. Here's my foot. Here's the dinosaur foot. My foot, dinosaur. My foot, dinosaur foot. Wow. That's so cool. This is crazy. See it when it's a toe. Right there. A toe there, a toe there, a toe there. Wow, yeah, that's crazy. Look, you're an excavator mm -hmm. now. <laughs> That's so cool. Luke and Dale. We is there another one? <laughs> That's Luke and I as wild turkeys. We're currently going, well it says we were going like two miles an hour. We were probably really pushing the limits on corduroy out here, driving up and down these big hills and on all these gravel roads, but we'll see what he can do. Okay, they're moving aside now. 
Oh, just kidding. They're gonna go back in front of the RV. <laughs> Good thing he slowed down, huh? <laughs> He's like, you're gonna get to my babies. <laughs> Apparently, this is a thing out here. Cows just go out in the middle of the road and make you wait for them. <laughs> They're so cute, though. <laughs> oh my gosh. Look at the little ones over there playing. Cows. <laughs> that one looks like a puppy dog running. Wow. They're pretty fast. So we are in Clayton, New Mexico at Valero All Sub Station, and gas here is. $3.49. It's like the cheapest in the area, so we decided to stop here. Oh, wow, there's a dragon coming out of that building. Cool. And it's for rent or sale, it said. Yeah. <laughs> oh crap, their tire blew up. Like it's shredded. Dang. Good thing they got pulled over in time. Warning, watch for snakes. Alright. Mm -hmm. Those burritos were delicious, yeah? Much needed. Now we're gonna stretch our legs for a little bit at this nice little rest area. Over the left shoulder we have Sierra Grande, the largest extinct volcano in northeastern New Mexico. Elevation 8,720 feet. Is that this right here, huh? Cool. So first we were trying to climb up a hill and it was just not shifting very well. And then our ears popped, and then we saw a sign that said 7,834 foot elevation. And then all of a sudden we were in Colorado, almost missed it, did miss it. We turned this corner and here's all the Colorado mountains. Just all of a sudden, like what? <laughs> we're here. What is the one thing they have in almost every state? It's in every state, <laughs> without a doubt. <laughs> every state. It's Walmart. Oh, there are RVs! I get really excited when we see other RVs. It's like a dog, seeing other dogs. So we were gonna stay a little rest area, but Luke said we might just stay here tonight. I mean, we kind of need to mark off staying in a Walmart parking lot off our bucket list, don't we? Yeah, I mean, it's kind of one of those things I also don't want it. Yeah, but I mean, here it doesn't look that bad in this area. I mean, there's other people here. Good morning, guys. We're in Colorado, and we stayed at the Walmart parking lot last night because we saw a sign that said we could stay for 24 hours in our RV and it snowed last night. So the parking lot's pretty clear. However, our neighbors next to us, it, the top of the RV is pretty covered in snow and we're thinking ours probably is as well because we're not getting any kind of charge on our solar. But Luke's about to go out there and assess the situation.
hot. I know, I thought it would be colder. Yeah, it's not as cold as I thought it would be. Yeah. So we're in Trinidad, Colorado, and like I told you guys, it's snowing, but the weather here is really weird. We got all bundled up, and then we walked outside, and it was hot, but it's 33. So confused. Anyway, Luke was up there shoveling the snow off the roof, and then I got up there and helped him a little bit, and I guess we inspired our neighbor to do the same. Luke asked him if he wanted help, but he declined. He's really nice though, right? Nice guy, said he lives in Colorado. So, yep, we are, we're good to go. And we'll probably just chill for a little bit. I think our check-in time at our next park is, what was it babe, like two, two o'clock? It said our check-out time was 1 p.m., which is like the latest check-out time I've ever heard of. So that's kind of cool. But anyway, I'll update you guys when there's something interesting to see.